Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. My name is Noemi and in today's video, we're going to continue the minimalism challenge. If you guys are not aware, I'm doing the minimal blah, minimalism challenge for the month of July. I'll go ahead and link week one in the description box below if you haven't already seen that video. In today's video, I'm going to go ahead and film week two with you guys. I actually have a couple days to make up for it that I didn't film from the weekend. So let's go ahead and start with day eight. So I went ahead and went through the cabinet underneath my sink in my bathroom and I found five items that I want to go ahead and get rid of. But for day eight, I need to get rid of eight items. So we are here in my office. And so I went through the closet in my office, which we're going to be going through for this entire week. This office closet, I just kind of hold a lot of supplies and just miscellaneous items and storage. And so I found three items, um, three like house decor items that I want to go ahead and get rid of. So let me show you all the items I'm going to get rid of for day eight. All right, guys, so these are the items for day eight that I'm going to go ahead and get rid of. I'm going to start over here. So these are the five items that I'm going to get rid of that I found underneath the cabinet in my bathroom. We've got a nail file, two brushes, a massage gel, and a face mask. Then over here, we've got this cast iron decor thing that you can hang up and two shadow boxes. I used to be really big into crafting and I made a bunch of shadow boxes. I actually got a bunch from Michael's that were like buy one, get one. And these two have just been hanging out in the closet here for some time now. So it's about time to get rid of them. So here we've got eight items for day eight. All right, guys, like I said, we've got a couple days to make up for. So here next to my desk, I have this magazine holder and it has exactly 10 women's health magazines. So I'm going to go ahead and get rid of these. So I went and bought something and when I went to check out, it actually gave me the option to go ahead and get a women's health magazine subscription for a year. And as I got each magazine, I actually didn't flip through them. I just started to collect them. And so I put the magazines and the magazine holder next to my desk thinking that I would go through them one day and I just haven't. So you want to know what? It's time to just let them go. So I'm going to go ahead and get rid of 10 magazines for day nine. All right guys, so we've made it to day 10 here. I'm in my office going through the closet. I had these plastic tubbies with just a bunch of office supplies. So I decided to go through them while watching Dawson's Creek and drinking a protein shake. Um, I'm actually gonna end up getting rid of these plastic tubbies sometime during this challenge just cause I would prefer to have any office supplies that I need in the drawer that um, is underneath my desk. So that'll be for a future day. But in today's video, we are going to go through the items for day 10. All right, guys. So these are the items I'm going to get rid of for day 10. So here I've got a Women's Health magazine, two Muscle and Fitness Hers magazines, a stack of envelopes. I found like a variety of envelopes that I've just collected over time and just decided to get rid of half of it. And then here I have four different like magazines that I picked up from my last trip that I took to McDonough this accordion file folder, and then my planner from last year. So we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10 items for day 10. Hi guys, welcome back to the minimalism challenge. Today is day 11, which means I have to get rid of 11 items today. So I just went through the closet here in my office and I found 11 items that I'm gonna get rid of for day 11. But I also found a whole other stack of magazines. So I'm gonna go ahead and include day 12 in today's video because I found 13 magazines that I'm gonna get rid of for day 12. But before we get to that, let me go ahead and show you what I'm getting rid of for day 11. All right guys, so these are the items I'm gonna go ahead and get rid of for day 11. I'm gonna start over here. I have four American Fitness magazines that I'm gonna go ahead and get rid of. This is the box to my Apple AirPods and the box to my Apple iPhone. They've just been sitting there and really have no purpose, so I'm gonna go ahead and get rid of them. I did take the um, manuals inside out and keep those, but the boxes I'm gonna go ahead and get rid of. And then this is an old cable for my MacBook Air. Um, as you can see, it's discolored, it actually stopped working um or not stopped working but like it would work on and off so i ended up ordering a new one and i just kept this one as a backup but honestly there really is no need so i'm gonna go ahead and get rid of this one because it doesn't really work 
And then this is a mouse that you can connect via USB. Um, this one also had the same issue as the cable, um, as the charger there, that sometimes it would work and sometimes it wouldn't. So I ended up just getting a wireless mouse. So there's no need for this one. And then these are just some name tags slash lanyards that I got from some events that I went to. This was Playlist Live from 2018, Blog Her Conference from 2018, and this was from the This Is It Michael Jackson movie. So yeah, so these are the items I'm going to get rid of for day 11. And for day 12, I found a whole stack of magazines that I completely forgot that I had. Here I've got six health um, magazines, and I've also got seven shape magazines. So I'm going to go ahead and get rid of these 13 magazines for day 12. Hi guys, welcome back to the Minimalism Challenge. So today is day 13, which means I have to get rid of 13 items today. So I just got done going through my medicine cabinet and I found 13 expired items that I'm gonna go ahead and get rid of for day 13. So it's not what you think. I actually don't have a lot of medication because I don't like to take medication. I'd rather just go through the pain and let my body do what it needs to do to get well. But I did find some items that were expired. So let me go ahead and show you what I'm getting rid of for day 13. All right guys, so these are the items I'm gonna go ahead and get rid of for day 13. So I'm gonna start here at the bottom. Here I've got a tub of Neosporin, two eye drops, this expired bug spray, expired hydrogen peroxide, rubbing alcohol, three containers of sunscreen, and four containers of hand sanitizer. So these are the items I'm gonna get rid of for day 13. Hi guys, welcome back to the Minimalism Challenge. Today is day 14, which means I have to get rid of 14 items today. So I went ahead and looked in the cabinets here in my kitchen and found some items I'm gonna go ahead and get rid of. So let me show you what I'm getting rid of for day 14. All right guys, so these are the items I'm gonna go ahead and get rid of for day 14. I'm gonna start with the vases. So I have a collection of flower vases. Um, whenever I receive flowers, they're usually delivered and they come with a vase. So I had nine. I'm gonna go ahead and keep these five over here, but I'm gonna get rid of these four. So we've got four flower vases, this empty box that I found underneath the sink, this empty bottle of Drano because my guest bathroom um, sink gets clogged sometimes. This is a spray bottle that I was using for bleach, but the spray bottle nozzle part itself doesn't really work anymore, so I'm gonna get rid of that. This is a, an empty box of the water filter for my fridge. So I went ahead and went on Amazon and found it and saved it to one of my lists so I don't have to keep the box anymore. These are three dead batteries, and then these are two small flashlights that don't really work, and I actually went through my hurricane supplies, and I have three new flashlights that I bought last year, so I'm gonna go ahead and get rid of these. And then this is just an empty bottle that I found. Um, it actually leaks water, or liquid I should say, from the top, so I'm actually gonna go ahead and get rid of it. I actually did used to have measurements on the side, which have been worn off, so I'm gonna get rid of that. So we've got four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 items for day 14. Thank you so much for watching today's video. Stay tuned for next week where I'll be sharing the items that I get rid of for week three of the minimalism challenge. Don't forget to like this video by giving me a thumbs up and subscribing. I upload videos every Tuesday and Thursday. Until next time. Bye guys.